so how to create a record type so to create a record type again you need to go to setup you need to go to setup and build customize accounts and then you have a concept called record types you have a concept called record types click on record type now i'll create a new record type main it let's say sales accounts i'm creating account called sales account and ensure that you are enabling accounts which are related to sales stream accounts which are related to sales stream this is my record type and after completion you will understand why we need this time and i'll select a page layout called sales layout account sales layout and then save clear so now let me go back now what type of layout you are seeing just remember this this is very important now you are seeing like account information additional information and all those stuff right now let's say i'm creating a new account account name is sales account yes now active is came here active is came here now rating equal to warm sla equal to silver serial number 12345 sla date is mandatory and then save now you can see this page layout is different from the existing page layout yes or no yes or no Yes. Yeah. Now let's say I'm creating a new layer, new account type called service account. This account, which is, will be gonna create by create by service P O. But ensure that you have to activate, you need to activate and enable for all profiles, enable for all profiles. Next. Because this is service, let me make support layout. Save. Now, let me create a new. Now, how many record types we have totally in account now? How many record types we have? two record types right sales and service how many record types we have two types sales account and service account right two things now if i click a new before and all what happened it directly went to the records to edit now what it will give an option to select which type of account you want to create sales account or service account it will ask you to create a sales account or a service account. Now if I select service account, continue. My page layout is something different. Let's observe one thing. I'm creating a new, that is service, this is sales. So what is the difference between these two? Here let's go with a required field. Account is the account name is the only field which is required at a service. But in service, sales, Account name, activate, SLA number, SLA expiration date, and SLA. How many fields? Totally five fields are required in a sales account. But in service, we have only one field which is required. Right? And order of the field you can see, SLA is at the account information section. But in account, service account, SLA is in different layout. So, it's very simple. Do you all agree? Everyone will have their own responsibilities. Right? If it is a manager, manager will have a more permissions. Whereas, when compared to the, his juniors or his subordinates, right? Right? 
Okay, so how why record types we needed? Record types will help us to moderate different types of records with a different set of validations. Like you will get a different views. Now what happening? Based on the type of record type, you are getting your own view, right? So what happened? You can assign a page layout for a record type to the profile. So one record type can have a multiple page layout, but one user will have only one page layout for one record type. It, the word itself is a totally confusing, I know. Very simple. Let me go to the again to the objects. Let's say view object. Mm, sorry. Page layouts. Let me go to the page layouts. Page layout assignment. This is sales account is a record type, service account is a record type. For a system administrator, for a system administrator, for a record type of sales account, what is the page layout you have? Account sales layout, right? So this is what I am saying. For one record type, for one profile, you will be having only one page layout assigned. For one profile to the pro record type compared with the record type, you have only one page layout can be assigned. 